Sure, so I know there's been a lot of concern raised out uh, in the lay uh, media, on the internet and other social media kind of areas that uh, have raised questions about whether COVID-19 vaccines could cause infertility or could, could cause problems where a woman could not conceive or maybe not carry a pregnancy. This is absolutely untrue. There is no scientific plausibility to how this would happen. The theory that's been posed by some uh, in this sort of misinformation campaign against the vaccines is that the vaccine generates, um, your, causes your body to generate this protein called spike protein. And that's a protein that's found on the coronavirus itself. And it's what our body makes antibodies to, to fight off the infection. So there was this theory that the, the protein looks a lot like another protein in the placenta. And so what if your body made antibodies to that protein? It just doesn't work that way. Number one, the proteins are very, very different. Even though there's a tiny bit that looks the same, the rest of them are totally different. So it wouldn't work that way. Number two, the way those mRNA vaccines work, they're very, very specific on the kind of protein they're gonna make and how they put together these amino acid building blocks to make a protein. So you can't make a mis mistake to make one protein for another. And the third reason is that we haven't seen those kind of complications in women who have gotten pregnant um, and had COVID infection. So if there was a concern about this antibody uh, or these sort of proteins cr crisscrossing and mixing up, we would have seen complications like that in women already early on in their pregnancies, say potentially having higher chances of miscarriage or in later pregnancy having problems with the placenta itself. And that just simply has not been the case.